Let's talk a minute about uh, power breakers and circuits in the hut. Um, so we have two 220 outlets uh, designed for espresso machines. Um, they are back behind the grinder there. If you can see one of them, you can't see the other one. Uh, the left hand um, espresso machine is currently plugged into one of those. Uh, we have room to plug a second espresso machine in uh, just there. Those are both on independent breakers in the breaker box. Um, I'm doing a video. <laughs> if I remember right, there are two circuits on this wall. Um, I think one high, one low, but don't quote me on that. I believe these here are on, and this one here are on one breaker. Back behind here, there is a unused 20 amp breaker um, that is separate. We might go to that one as well. Sit closest at the bottom of the screen there. Um, that is on a different breaker than the other two there though. And those are I think on the same as these over here. Um, we have Outlet, outlet, and left hand outlet here on another breaker. The right hand one here is on a separate 20 amp breaker that is controlled by that switch up there. Excuse me. Uh, let me see. This outlet here is on the same breaker as this outlet down here. I think. These ones here are um, all on, this, on that same breaker as well. Uh, water heater, I believe, is on its own breaker. Uh, just be aware there's two GFI breakers, uh, outlets on the inside, one here and one over in that corner. Um, the one over in, there is a switch over in this corner here that leads to one of the outside um, sockets as well. Let me see, let me check with the on the breaker panel. Espresso, espresso. Oh, there's an AC. Um, uh, 220 as well in there. That's pretty self-explanatory to anybody who's looking into that, I think. Um, there is both a mini split up on the wall and another part of the unit inside the area. This all then goes to that breaker panel and there's a master cutoff switch over there. I don't think anybody watching this at that.